committed to providing world-class cardiovascular care. Welcome to Cardiac and Vascular Catheterization Laboratory, which houses a comprehensive range of top-of-the-line equipment backed by experienced and highly competent interventional cardiologists and support staff who are trained to handle complex cases, thus assuring patients of the best possible and the most timely cardiac care. The Cardiac and Vascular Laboratory provides a wide range of services that use minimally invasive techniques. We use uh, catheters, which are small, thin tubes that we insert through the body, to the skin in x-ray as an imaging device to uh, diagnose and treat a wide range of medical conditions. Our cath lab started in 2002 in the old hospital. In the 14 years that had the uh, cath lab, basically grown from an old, small, cramped cath lab in the old hospital to a new, fully integrated cath lab with two state-of-the-art imaging devices. We've grown to the forefront of uh, coronary intervention. In 2013, actually, we did more than 1,000 coronary diagnostics and interventional procedures, which was the most out of any institutions in the whole country. Cath Lab is home to a distinguished uh, field of uh, nationally recognized experts, experts in cardiac uh, electrophysiology and arrhythmia. These are experts that diagnose and treat irregularities in heartbeat. We also have experts in uh, pediatric intervention, basically offering the same services we do in adults to uh, patients that come in smaller packages, in babies and children. And also uh, nationally re recognized experts in catheter-based uh, neurosurgical intervention. They do uh, aneurysms in the brain, treat patients with strokes, and last but not least, we have an expert in uh, interventional radiology. Basically, these are the experts that do everything else uh, that we don't do, uh, still using catheters in the X-ray machine. Medical City Cardiac and Vascular Laboratory has indeed become bigger and better. Cardiac cath lab procedures are minimally invasive procedures performed by a cardiologist. Our patients coming in for these procedures have to be checked by one of these doctors first. What we do, basically, is to take a picture. These pictures are taken by a specialized X-ray camera. Using small catheters, we insert the dye. This dye against the X-ray will give us a picture of your internal structures. These pictures, they help your doctor diagnose or even treat your condition. We at the Medical City have a highly specialized team of doctors to help care for your child. We can close a variety of holes in the child, ASDs, PDAs, and VSDs. We can actually also open a variety of blood vessels or make a hole in the heart to make them survive. We are proud to say we at the Medical City have done the smallest and youngest child in the country. It was a premature baby, 1.3 kilograms, and we were able to successfully open a blood vessel in this child's heart. The Medical City's Cardiac and Vascular Catheterization Laboratory has been getting better each passing year, saving more lives and giving our patients the opportunity to live longer more fulfilling lives. Ang angiogram ay napakagaling kasi makikita agad sa iyo kung ano yung sakit mo sa puso, kung ilang ugat ang iyong barado. Actually, pinakita nga sa akin sa computer kung ano yung trabaho ng puso ko. Magaling talaga, natulungan talaga niya ako kasi alam ko at alam ng mga doktor kung ano yung dapat nagawin sa akin. Nakita sa angiogram na hindi ako pwedeng i-angioplasty kasi masisira daw yung bato ko sa dami ng stent na ilalagay sa akin kung i-angioplasty ako. Kaya mas maganda makita mo na sa angiogram bago ka magpa-bypass. Translagial access to cardiac catheterization, simply put, is doing coronary angiogram, angioplasty, and stenting through the wrist. It is called transradial because we make use of the radial artery at the underside of the wrist. In contrast, the conventional axis makes use of the femoral artery in the groin. Doing the procedure from the wrist instead of the groin offers several advantages. First, it has less complications. The studies have shown that transradial procedures carry a lower risk for vascular complications like bleeding, hematoma formation, and the potential need for blood transfusion when compared with the conventional way of doing procedures from the groin. Second, it offers increased comfort to the patient. After a transradial procedure, patients can immediately stand up, move around, and walk to the bathroom. Those who undergo a simple coronary angiogram can even go home after three to four hours. 
On the other hand, patients who undergo the same procedure to the groin will have to be admitted because they are required to lie flat for at least six hours. Third, it costs less. Lowered risk of complications, early ambulation and discharge translate to significant savings for the patient. Clearly, translatal access for coronary angiogram, angioplasty and stenting is a better option with a much improved patient safety and comfort and decreased procedure cost. Here at the Medical City, we treat each patient not as a case, but as a unique individual who deserves the best informed medical care. Which is why acquiring technologies such as this, which provide clearer, more accurate assessment of his condition, is so important. World-class cardiovascular care, only at the Medical City, where patients are partners.